two and two at home. We did this last week. Uh, it got warm, it got muggy, and strong storms popped up, bringing us heavy rain, lots of lightning, and severe storms. This one behind me, which is just now expiring. This is in far northeastern Franklin County. That's Centerville under the lightning. This is southern Warren County. There's Highway 43, extends all the way down into Nash County. But in addition to producing heavy rain and frequent lightning, we're also getting reports of hail. It's quarter-sized hail that's big enough to uh, uh, put a little scare into you as you're driving around. And of course, the heavy rain. That continues with storms west and north of I-85, now in northern Durham County, right around Bahama, and from Hillsboro on into northern parts of Orange County. Those storms have also now slid into Person County. In fact, Roxborough, you guys are getting some heavy downpours with frequent lightning right now as well. We've got another batch that's getting ready to move in from the southwest. Believe it or not, it's dry here in Wake County. We got our dosage about an hour ago, but from Carthage down through Pinehurst, Southern Pines, Aberdeen area, another round of heavy, heavy rain with frequent lightning getting ready to move in. We'll widen out and put everything into motion. It's all moving from southwest to northeast. And again, if you've got dry weather now, there is more on the way. So we will keep the storms in the forecast through 7, 8, and 9 o'clock tonight as temperatures hold in the 70s. We'll dry out a little late tonight, but we've got another batch of everything coming tomorrow. Heat, humidity, and storms. I'll walk you through tomorrow, hour by hour, in just a few minutes.